2016 marks half a century of service and innovation at Piedmont Technical College. To celebrate this milestone, we've invited members of our community, past and present, to share their PTC experiences. This year, we celebrate a milestone in the history of Piedmont Technical College, our 50th anniversary. It humbles me to think about all the individuals that have worked here, all the students that have attended here, and the impact the college has had on their lives and the communities. As we celebrate this 50th year anniversary, I think we need to look forward into the future and continue to work diligently to ensure that the college will remain at the center of the economic growth and vitality of our region. We believe that there is no segment of higher education that can more profoundly impact the quality of life of an individual and the economic success of a community than what occurs in a two-year technical community college. I joined the college as a full-time staff member as Dean of Students in 1969. If my math is right, that means Piedmont was only three years old. And we had two buildings, but we made good use of it, and we were a happy group that worked here. I started my employment with the technical college system in the very beginning of the, the system. And I love teaching. I love the students. I love doing uh, everything about the educational uh, arena. When I was here as a student, I was very engaged in leadership activities. When I came back to work here, I had the privilege of working under Laura Ann Stevens. Um, Laura Ann was the director of counseling services by the time I got back. And she and I would go to conferences, room together, get there whatever way we could, and we would go and find out what was going on in another college and come back and implement it here. So I learned how to be innovative, how to learn from others, and just how to self-develop. We were always looking at ways to improve and do things differently. So I've kind of carried that with me. My brother and my dad were real inspirations for me when they came to Piedmont Technical College. I saw that they went through Piedmont Technical College and they were very successful and I felt like that would be wonderful for me. My dad graduated in engineering graphics and my brother graduated in automated manufacturing technology. And both my dad and my brother continued on after that and gained higher levels of education. And that was wonderful for them. So I wanted to follow in their footprints. Well, when I started, I was very disappointed that there was no photography class. So I went and spoke with the president of Piedmont Technical College. He told me that if I could gain enough interest that he would consider it. So I started a petition. And this was somewhat before the internet so it was a hand signed petition that I took around with me every day and people signed it saying that they were interested in a photography program at Piedmont Technical College and once I had I think it was about 500 signatures I took it to the president of the college and he he said okay we're gonna try to make something happen and the next semester there was a photography one class I was a first generation student. I was the first person in my family to go to college. So what comes with that sometimes and what came with that with me was a lot of misdirection before Piedmont Tech. I'd earned a lot of college credits and no degree. Really didn't really have any idea what I wanted to do in terms of a major. I did what other people did or what I thought I should do. But at Piedmont I got direction. I got focus. People helped me think about pathways after Piedmont Tech. I got excited about actually graduating and got to experience what it felt like to finish something, to complete, and then go on and, and build on that. So it is a very supportive place. People actually cared about my success and they saw something in me that I didn't see in myself. And that will light a fire under you like nothing else because you can sort of take it from there once you start to believe in yourself and and just there was enough of a climate of of trust and genuineness here that I was able to take the steps I needed to pursue goals even before I believe what they were seeing. 
When I graduated from Piedmont Technical College and went to work for Capsa Jail, I found it quite rewarding. And I really enjoyed it. I got a lot of great experience. And then when I transitioned to Piedmont Technical College and started teaching here, that's truly where my passion for teaching started. And I knew I was doing what I should for the rest of my life. It was really awesome. And even now as a dean, I really love to teach and work with the students. Although I had planned to only stay in education for two years and then go back to work in industry, I never looked back. I uh, never did apply to go back into industry. I uh, enjoyed what I was doing and I stayed with the technical college system for 46 and a half years. Uh, about six years at Greenville Tech, about uh, 40 years here almost 40 years here at Piedmont Technical College. Beyond the personal impact on me and thousands of students who have come through here, uh, it, it has been my pleasure to observe what a tremendous difference the Technical College is. All 16 of us working together have reached every corner of our state to the point that we have almost half of all the people that enroll in higher education begin at the Technical Community College.